Hey there, it's Rob Knight, and I want to share my favorite setting for the function lever on the Lumix G9 camera. You can assign lots of different things to this little lever, and at this point it's unique to the G9. And it's just one of the features of the G9 that I have uh, come to rely on almost instantly after using it. The LCD screen on the top of the camera, and, uh, and this little function lever especially. So anyway, this setting is going to be really helpful if you're shooting sports or wildlife because it's going to allow you to basically lock the camera so that nothing changes. None of your settings change as far as your aperture and your shutter speed unless you manually go in and unlock it. So what you're going to do is use the menu button, go into the custom menu, which is the C menu with the wrench, then you're going to go to the operation menu. Now, in the operation menu on page three of six, you're going to find the FN lever setting. And you're going to go there and select front rear control dial lock. Okay. Now what that's going to do is lock the front dial and the rear dial, as you might have suspected. Now you can lock the settings. You can lock the buttons uh, on previous G series cameras on the GH5, on the G9, etc. but it doesn't lock the dials. So, for example, if you're shooting indoor sports, like a hockey game, you're really going to have to balance your exposure setting. You want the fastest shutter speed you can get, and you want your aperture wide open usually. So once you get that dialed in, you don't want that to change. And I can tell you from experience, it's a drag to accidentally tap this little lever just in handling the camera, and suddenly your exposure changes. And, you know, with the G9, you're shooting 20 frames a second. And now you've changed your exposure for 20 or 40 or 60 pictures before you even realize what's going on. So it's really important to be able to lock that dial. So now with the flick of this switch, I can lock that setting. I can get my exposure dialed in in uh, manual exposure and lock that setting in. It also works in aperture priority, shutter priority, whatever exposure mode that you're working in, uh, you'll lock that dial so that your exposure won't change while you're shooting. And that's super handy. Now there is a little workaround that I figured out when I'm using the Leica branded lenses that have the manual aperture ring on the lens barrel. If you use the front function lever to lock the dials, it does not lock this aperture ring. You can turn the aperture ring and change the, the exposure uh, even if the dials are locked. So it's pretty simple to work around it. You just put the aperture ring on the A setting. Now you can change the aperture with the front or real, rear dial on the camera. And if you lock it using this, the function lever, then you're locking the aperture and it won't move, right? So if you keep in mind, if you bump that aperture ring, it is going to change the aperture, but as long as you keep it in the A setting, then you can lock the aperture and the shutter speed uh, with the function lever set to lock those dials.